Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In Access, unlike many other Microsoft applications, you have three different types of windows in which you will perform tasks. You have the application window, which is the outer frame of the program, the database container, which holds all of the various objects inside of the database, and the object windows, which allow you to select particular database objects and then open or open them in design view. So when Access opens, you should just see the application window. The first database file you open inside of the application window appears within its own database container window. As you select the various objects inside the database container window and click open to open them or design to edit their structure, they appear in their own application little windows. So here we've got an object window, the order details table. Now the application window consists of the title bar at the top, the database toolbar, the menu bar where we have commands like file, edit, view, insert, tools, window, help, show me. And inside of that we have the actual database container. Now in the 2003 and XP versions you may also see the task pane appear at the right. And the task pane is used to accomplish various tasks within the actual access program. Now the database container, which is the window that appears inside the application window, consists of its own title bar, the open, design, and new button group, the objects pane, which is at the left side, and the actual database objects window. So as we select different object types, those types are then shown in the window to the right. Now if you're running Access 97, in Access 97 the database container just looked a little different. The objects which were typically listed on the left side in 2000, XP and 2003, in 97 they were actually tabs along the top that you could click to select. And for each tab you had Open, Design and New listed at the right side and those would normally appear at the top in the future. So they simply shuffled things around but you had the same basic options. Now each object in a database that you select and then click open or design for will appear in its own object window and that too will have its own title bar which displays its name and object type. And you'll see these as you open and edit the different objects in your access databases. You'll learn to manipulate the objects in all three windows in order to effectively use access. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.